guys welcome back to my channel so today I just thought I'd do a quick uh, swimwear haul for you from one of my favorite labels which is 437 swimwear disclaimer I um, do work with them in one of their bikinis the Kenzie bikini as um, I do receive uh, commission from the sales of this particular bikini but I will be showing you a few other stars as well and I just really like their swimwear brand as it's just really nice, simple, classic bikinis that don't go out of style and that look really nice on uh, most figure types. I find it really difficult bikini shopping. I think people might think, eh, no, you're like a fitness person. So like you'll have no trouble going into a store and finding a bikini that suits you. But I have quite a difficult figure to dress for bikinis. I think because I am quite flat chested, like I'm, like a, I'm a 10 a have no boobs, and I have like a, quite a long torso and then shorter legs, that most bikinis just look terrible on me. And I don't want to wear like a big padded bikini, I don't want to wear the really low cut, low rise bikini, because I don't need my torso to look any longer. If, you, if I have to wear those ones that are like really low, I look so bad. So that's why I am that girl that you see on Instagram pulling my bikinis up to my waist because it is just more flattering. Give a girl a break. Uh, example there. Um, <laughs> so yeah, so these are some of the bikinis that I like, the styles that I like as well, and I'll explain why I, why I like them. I def when I generally search for a bikini that looks good on me, it has to be a high-waisted, but not just high in the waist, but also high cut in the leg. So I'll show you what I mean when I have them on. And I also like something that has not is not fully padded on the bikini top. Uh, these ones don't have like an insertion for padding. They're just double lined and that's enough really to feel like secure in them, not like anything's going to show like your nipples or whatever when the fabric gets wet. And yeah, so let me begin hair up because I know me and I just cannot stop touching my hair. And I've had comments being like, if this chick doesn't stop touching your hair, I swear to God. So hair is up, no touching. <clears throat> the whole begin. So this is the Kenzie Bikini in blush, as you can see. Now this is like a tie-up front, so you can untie it, which I won't do because I don't want to show the whole world my nips. Uh, as you can see, it's like a high-rise style here, and you can kind of pull, they, they are supposed to be a bit more high-cut here on the legs. I mean, if you do want to, you can wear them lower like that, but you can kind of see, like, it's meant to be made to wear like that. Like, that's the fit of them. They kind of go a bit baggy there if you pull them down. So, I like that. And uh, this is the back. They are quite minimal on the butt cheeks. Now, I'm quite used to walking around my house, filming in bikinis like this, and taking photos. Um, it's another thing actually wearing this stuff to the beach. <laughs> So I wore this to the pool yesterday with my friend. I was like, I don't have any bikini and I was you know, feeling all good. And then I got up and I started walking around in it and I was like, oh my God, everyone can see my, oh God, don't say it. Everyone can see my ass cheeks. Like they're on full display. Like, I know that sounds really stupid, but I didn't like realize like how like when you're out in the open, I was like, oh my God, oh my God. Um, <laughs> but I got feeling comfortable getting it, getting it out there. I know it sounds like ridiculous because I show my ass all the time, but I'm not really used to wearing that really minimal butt style at the beach. I usually, I just wouldn't usually wear them at the beach. I would usually just take a lot of stupid photos at home and then wear like something quite modest. <laughs> but I do like wearing these. They're great tanning bikinis as well and it's easy to take your top off to get no tan lines. So yeah, they are super cute and they come in black and white. What was that? Oh, you want to see them? Uh, reversed 
<clears throat> which is a bit more like a sporty look. And if you want, you could do the whole under boob thing. I mean, you probably can't tell I'm doing the under boob thing because I have no boob to be under. But, um, so I always am scared that that's like the postman because it's like a window there. And if he pokes his head through, he'll see me doing this and it'll just be really embarrassing. So I'm always on edge. <laughs> So if you're at the beach and you're like, I feel like I've been here for too long and I'm wearing the same look, you can spice it up and turn your bikini around. Everyone will be like, whoa. Like J-Lo at the Grammys. So this is the Aubrey top and the Sanders bottom and I'm a bit mad about it. Like, usually when I try on like Lycra tire bikinis like this, they're kind of like baggy. I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, but these are like tight. Like these feel amazing, like so good. I don't even get any money from this one. Like if you guys buy this bikini, nothing happens to me. So <laughs> I'm just really excited by this. I love it. And it's got like little darts here as well. I used to study fashion design. Uh, so I'm actually quite passionate about like how things are made and the reasonings behind them and quality of fabric and all of that. So I really appreciate these kind of details and this kind of care that goes into clothing because I notice it and I know why it's there. So this helps with uh, shaping the breasts and it makes it fit a lot better and tighter so there's no gaping down here which I've had with other bandeau star bikinis. So this is great. And look, you don't have to wear it like me, like a dickhead. You can wear them like a normal person like that. Or you can wear them like an Instagram girl like this. This is the Jamie bikini, and this is very like glamorous, poolside, sexy. Like, I think I feel like amazing wearing this right now. I think I feel a little bit like ah, my body when I was like at the beach, but maybe then I just like fall into it and like feel myself, you know? Uh, <laughs> but, oh my god, I nearly undid it. Oh my god, you guys nearly saw everything. Oh my god. As you guys can see, it's like two really long straps that you tie up here, right? So you can choose to keep them tied up like this and just kind of go with the long flowy strap thingy. You can have a bit of fun and you can like do the double double cross which I like because it kind of like cinches in the waist and looks super cute from the back and there we go but is out everyone can see it now There's no going back so yeah I really like this bikini it's very like glamorous and cool and I do like that it's still like really sexy and you can like get your gut out like you can have like lots of burgers and fries and then wear this to the beach and still look all really sexy so it's pretty much ideal bulky bikini because it looks great on your butt but when you don't have abs nobody can see <laughs> So that 
that's it guys i hope you liked it and if you have any questions about the swimwear just leave a comment below and i will see you on the flip side i never know how to finish off these things it's awkward bye